Today I wanted to cover something pretty cool that I just saw. This video was released uh, uh, just yesterday and it's from uh, the Redwood AI team and they made this pretty cool humanoid robot and I kind of wanted to talk about it and just, you know, kind of give you guys my thoughts and like kind of show you guys um, kind of something that I thought was pretty cool. So this is kind of meant to be like a, like a humanoid robot that kind of helps with... Uh, everyday tasks in homes and stuff so they're kind of showcasing its mobility functions here in this video and you can see here it's climbing stairs that's a pretty pretty cool and and here as well omnidirectional navigation and this scene i thought was really cool where it was kind of helping in the garage and helping uh this man work on on his car and kind of just even handing over this wrench here and i was like Dang, this is kind of getting um, kind of kind of eerie and kind of like even scary in a sense. It's like like wow, it's kind of like taking kind of looks a little too human now, right? These movements are all so human-like, and you're even sidestepping like a human. So that's a uh, that's this one video. We have a couple more though, and here we have the one where uh, and in this one it's. A full video where it's like he's helping the the team kind of work on on the car here, and it'll you know, still kind of take some some getting used to, of course. But I thought this was pretty cool, and it's kind of using like AI and uh, and also like pairing that up with uh, like locomotion and stuff. So I thought that was cool. This was with this blog that. I saw apparently they're like using so basically there's so much like there's so much randomized uh like there's there's so many random or just very hard to calculate physics um parameters in the real world so in training they use random parameters so that like to make noise so that the the machine can kind of like adjust to that is what I'm guessing is what I'm kind of seeing here um and they're using a two-stage controller system with a higher-level uh, planner. Planner being like which converts the commands into human-like movements, and a lower-level controller which uses RL to follow motions while staying balanced. I don't know. I really, I mean, I just saw this and I was like, I'm gonna make a video on it. But it's pretty cool. I think that this can really. I don't know if it can like really be uh, seen in how like in homes. Um, in the US or just in the world like in the next couple of years but I feel like you might see them in like 10 but this is this is certainly kind of uh kind of sci like futuristic and kind of makes you think like like wow kind of came so far in the past couple of years because you couldn't really see any humanoid robots in the, like I don't know like five years ago or even whatever um we were entering high school or middle school but yeah so i oh and there's even this video of it playing soccer so i was like that's that's so cool anyways that's uh that's all we have for today if you want to see more of me just talking about some cool uh robotics or ai stuff that i saw then um let me know